My name is Wayne Pels and I am the script supervisor on Heartland. After I went to film school and graduated in 94 and was into the business pretty much straight away. Uh, I started in commercials for a couple years, um, left commercials for long format and then I was a grip for about six months. I did props for about six months and then I had the opportunity to move into the script supervisor position. Um, which I've never looked back. I just love it so much that uh, I've never really considered switching departments. I have been on Heartland for all 15 seasons, everything except the very first episode. My position entails uh, quite a few things. So initially, when I first get the script, I will do a breakdown. So I time the script scene by scene and estimate how long it's going to run. And based on this, they can either cut scenes out if it's too long or add scenes if it's too short. And then once we start shooting, I will work with the director to make sure that we cover all the parts of the script on camera. I work closely with the actors to make sure they get their dialogue correct. And when we're rolling, I'm I take note of all the action that the actors do on camera so that we can match it from shot because we shoot out of sequence and we shoot m many shots within the same scene. Um, we just have to make sure that the action matches so that the editors can cut it together, cut it together as well as possible. Uh, so uh, fundamentally I am the editor's eyes and ears on set when we shoot. The challenging part of my position can be when we have scenes with a lot of actors in. So there's only one of me on set, but if we have 10 actors at a table eating, I have to note when all of them take a bite, when all of them take a sip, and with which hand that they do that. So it can be a little bit of a struggle to keep up at times when we have a fast paced scene with a lot of actors, but that is also part of the thrill. I make a lot of notes. Um, I have a script that I work with as we shoot. Um, so you can kind of just see a little bit of my shorthand there, really um, nobody would really understand what that means except me, but I'll just use a color coding system so I know which take um, the notes are for and uh, even what shot the, the notes are for. So just keeping diligent notes as quickly as I can is the biggest help in that, in that kind of a situation. Favorite part of my position is being in that inner loop of creative decision making, I guess we can call it. So, you know, you will have huddles with the director and the director of photography, myself, the first AD and the actors, and often we'll work through any problems that may arise. Um, just to be part of that creative hub is, uh, I find, a very exciting part of the job. And, you know, it's been, it's been a ride for sure. Uh, never in my life would I have dreamed I'd be on a show that would run this long. Um, but by the end of the first season, I had fallen in love with this. The people and the places and the animals, uh, so it's not uh, it's not a chore to come back from year to year. I really really enjoy it here. I have a lot of fun. It's a, it's a really great show. We have a, a really great down to earth cast of just just normal human beings, and really we become a, a family over the years. Um, so you know I would have to say you know the people that I work with would definitely be my favorite part of the show. Um, one anecdote I have. Um, so this was going back season three or four, I would say. Um, it was a scene with uh, Sean Johnson and Jessica Steen. And in the scene, at one point, Sean stands up, or Jack stands up to walk out the front door. And the dialogue that he had to stand up on was, what plans was, was the line of dialogue. So we kind of had a little bit of a back and forth, and I, I stood my ground because I believed that I was correct. And finally, he kind of looked at me, he was like, are you sure? Are you absolutely sure? And I was like, 100% positive. And we kind of came up with this little, gag between the two of us that whenever that moment arises I'll just look at him and say what plans and he'll know that I that, I, that I'm right or that I believe that I'm right <laughs> it's just a little secret code between us not so secret anymore I get that. <laughs> yeah.